In this video, I'm going to teach you how to turn on PC without power button. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. As you might be aware, most cases will have a power button that when pressed will power on your PC, of course. However, if you are still in the process of building your PC or you don't have a case or yours is not working, then there is an actual workaround that allows you to power on your PC without using the button. For this, you will need a screwdriver and you need to meet some requirements. First of all, it's important that you connect the 8 pin power supply cable and the 24 pin power supply cable. These will be connected respectively to these slots on your motherboard and then these slots on the side. So the 24 pin goes on the side and the 8 pin goes over here at the top. Make sure that they are properly connected between power supply and the motherboard. With this done, you might also want to insert some sticks of RAM, however many you want, and of course get the CPU installed. Otherwise, it isn't going to go past the post screen. With this done, you are good to go. You don't even need a GPU. Of course, if you want one, go ahead and install, but now you will be able to power it on. In order to do this, we need to look for the front panel. The front panel pins are usually going to be at the bottom right corner of your motherboard, but this will differ for every single brand or manufacturer, so I cannot give you specific instructions for your model in this video. It's very important that you check the manual for your specific model, or you look at the bottom right and you try to locate F panel which refers to front panel. Once you find these pins, you will be able to make a bridge between them to power on your PC. So these two pins in this specific image that I chose as an example are going to be the power pins. So you have to bridge them by placing a screwdriver between them like this. So all that you have to do is place a screwdriver between these pins. This will bridge them and essentially give power to your PC, so it is going to power up once. It's important to make sure that the switch on the back of your PSU is set to the on position, so it is providing power to the motherboard, and that you connected the 8 pin, 24 pin, and optim optimally a CPU and a RAM. And as long as you bridge these two pins, you will be good to go. If you put the screwdriver elsewhere, don't worry, nothing bad is going to happen. However, of course, these are not going to be the power pins, so it won't boot. If you aren't sure which pins are the power pins for your specific motherboard, like I mentioned previously, check the manual for your specific model. It is always going to be listed, and once you locate the two power pins, you will be good to go. I hope I was able to help you on how to turn on PC without power button. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching!